Hello, 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 YouTube on this hump, 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 hump day, hump day, Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. It is the 10th already. My calendar and my, well, yep, my watch is saying that it's 10 of March. It's the 10th of March already. Oh my goodness, and it's 10 o'clock, 10.45 in the morning. So I don't know what I'm going to post this video, but it will be today on the 10th of March, 2021. <laughs> I'm bouncing on my fitness ball with my lovely, lovely fitness tracker. <laughs> Listening to a little bit of, of, of some Afro beats. And I'm coming here, Miss Atlanta. Hello, hello, hello. Smiling and waving. Your girlfriend, virtual wifey here. On a on a hump 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 day, look way speed winding it up, winding it up Wednesday. <laughs> I am none other than the who the love goddess, your girlfriend. Let me dip to the left over here. Look over here, dip to the left. Oh, dip to the left, dip down. Your girlfriend, virtual wifey, wifey, wifey here. Miss Atlanta from MissAtlantaDream.com. Mm. Uh, dreamsuniverse.me mini vids goddess ATL thick dream of course I'm on OnlyFans goddess ATL thick dream as well and your tumblr your tumblr miss Atlanta thick dream so um, coming here with updates on this hump day Wednesday and I got kids in the kitchen Homework, homeschool going on. I'm, I'm supposed to be waist beating. You got my waist beat tray behind me. Kitchen noise might be in the background a little bit. Got the aquarium going on. Anyway, anyway, anyway. This is the house that is lived in. <laughs> we live in our living room. We live in our living room. We live in our living room. So, um, one update I want to talk about here. And I don't know why I didn't just have a little table so I could just bend down. I'm going to get all up in my boobies and get all of my boobies and shit. Anyway, my update with Ancestry, Ancestry.com. I'm going to tell y'all something. I am not pleased right now with my process with Ancestry.com because, one, I haven't gotten my results back. And I've done not one test, but two tests. Because the other one got lost in the mail. Don't know where it is. Never arrived in Utah at the facilities where they uh, do the DNA stuff for the Ancestry.com. So they sent me back free of charge. Yes, of course. Another kit. I sent it back. Now they're telling me 20 to 26. I think it's 26 days or 25 days. Business days. That'll be before I get my freaking results back from Ancestry DNA. My review so far, not good. Not good at all. Because remember, y'all, I am doing my Ancestry DNA story and my son, okay? My S-U-N. They screwed up his results in the lab. I don't effing know how. They didn't say. We have not gotten his replacement kit as of today. And it's going on a month. Y'all hear me? A month. He has not gotten his replacement kit. I was like, you know what? We're just going to take this one step at a time. Let's work on mine. We'll work on finding out where the hell his is. And then, and then we'll, maybe we'll have some results before what? Summer maybe. July is my birthday. <laughs> May is my 14 years. I look. Being on this here thing, on this here internet, this whole internet thing. 14 years, y'all. Miss Atlanta Dream. Miss Atlanta has been on the internet. Yes, this is my anniversary in May. But anyway, we'll see. By my anniversary, will my DNA results be processed with Ancestry? I'll keep y'all posted. Y'all be the first ones to know. But I had to like, Ellen, you know what? I didn't even do a YouTube to let my subscribers know what the bleep uh, is going on with my journey. I told my mom, I'm like, Mom, I've got my results. She's like, mm. You know, my mom's like, mm. Mm. Speaking of my mom, she's doing well. 
Um, I don't know many of you all who saw my post on Instagram and Facebook. Shout out to you all. We lost my one and only left great uncle. I have no more great anything left in my family. My last living of the greats in my family, my grandfather, um, brother, who just turned 90, to COVID, which was on February the 27th. So thank you for the love, 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 the love that you all sent me for shouting out my uncle, who is all, who is also a veteran with the Army. Thank you all. Love, love, love. I love you all. Love, love, love to you and your family. Uh, so what happened with Unc? Unc is a, he was not one of those like, you know, 90 year olds creeping around. No, 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 no. My Unc and my auntie, who they were married almost, what, 60 some years? Who y'all know been married 60 some years? They were still married to the day he transitioned. Yes. So listen to this though. My uncle was mobile. True man of God, y'all. You can't hear nothing bad about my uncle if I had to say this is the type of man I want when I reconsider marriage, which I am, by the way. <laughs> you know, I am reconsidering marriage, but if I had to say, universe, send me this type of man, my uncle. Lord rest his soul. God, God is, you know, I know I feel him all around me. I would want a man of God like him. Okay. Home with the wife, family man. Of course, he was in the church, deacon. You know, he was a deacon, deacon. And I can't say, excuse me, I'm spitting. I'm just so excited. You know, <laughs> you know how you get when you get excited. You can't say anything negative about my uncle. I don't know no man. I don't know no woman that you can't you could you could say all good things about nah he definitely lived his life authentically and truth and as i said at his uh services on saturday he lived his life with the hopes of living an even better one on the other side in the next room you know and i love i love that it makes me just so happy and it makes me um, excited to know that there are men that still exist. He was 90 years old, but honey, I know he got, you know, some type of opposites that not related to me. Not, not really opposite, but you know what I mean. Some men, a kindred spirit that's out here, that's like my uncle. Uh, uh, look, heavenly matchmakers, <laughs> energetic matchmakers, y'all hear me? Send me a God man. Like my uncle who just transitioned, but 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 someone who was aligned with all of me, 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 you hear me? All of me, definitely. So that was that was that was that. Um, 90 years old, that was a great life, and I'm so happy that I had those followers and supporters and friends who sent their love and their positive words of encouragement to my family. And uh, it was not a sad day. It was not a sad day, his passing. But what really, I knew it didn't happen just for my family, but I know, you know, I had to think about it, like, wait a minute, he's 90, he fell, and then he got sick, and then he got COVID. So it was not just the COVID that took him. So I had to say that real quick. I had to go in there. But it was not just the COVID. No, it was his injury that made him go to the hospital. And in the hospital is where he became sick with the COVID. Yeah. So I'm still living a social distancing life for the most part. For the most part, that is. I'm home right now. I'm home right now. We in homeschool mode right now. I'm a homeschool mode right now. So I'm pretty much in. I slowed it down as far as going out and things of that nature. I get a lot of things delivered in. Not those type of things like I used to, you know. So I am right now, I'm fasting, still doing my ritual, calling in the beloved. The beloved. You know. Mm -hmm, I love a man. Hi, honey. Hi, baby. Hi, honey. Wherever you, wherever you are in the world, I'm still here holding it down. You girl, you bet. Yes, I am. Yes, I is. Yes, I is. Yes, I am. But I'm just excited um, to still be here and rocking it out, forging my path, 
I have an event that I'm attending as a vendor to sell my, my lovely waist beads drums, my lovely waist beads drums here in Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, and it is sold out for both shows. It's a burlesque show. Shout out to sexandsensuality.com. Okay. Mika Nicole and her crew. They're going to be turning up March 20th. And I'll be there selling my lovely sensuality infused waist bead strands, y'all. Yeah, 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 yeah. And maybe one day, who knows, I'll have my own burlesque event or hmm, maybe collab with hers. You never know, y'all. You never know. You never know. You never know. But yeah, I look forward to that on the 20th. And I am so procrastinating right now. I have an audition to do for some voiceover work, some voiceover work. If you see me acting and feeling like, oh, she's acting kind of like very lighthearted and kind of quirky, it's because I have to get in the mood. I have to get in the mood. So I'm, I'm doing different voices and trying to, you know, tap back into my, my creative side and my sensuality, you know, my erotic side. I, I got to put it all into, you know, one and just <clears throat> eat it all. That's how I drink a lot of tea. So I got to drink some tea, make sure my throat, make sure my throat is, is right. You know, I don't. Want to not sound sexy when I'm I'm doing my my voiceover work, you know? I can I can change it into to that, or I can get like kind of high pitch and and yes, like this. And and I am still the love goddess. I am your lover, your girlfriend, and your sensually stallion creatrix here on a Wednesday, March the tenth, twenty twenty one. Yes, I am. I am her. She's me. <laughs> So I have to get in a playful mood to, to tap into that. Okay? Okay? So I have been procrastinating. Bad dream. Bad, 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 bad. And I'm spitting bad. <laughs> I am I am bad for that. Not that I... For some people when they procrastinate, it's fear. It's not fear for me. It's just getting the microphone set up, making sure everybody's quiet. I mean, what? Getting my own little at-home bubble home studio have some like you know um breathe a little bit you know I gotta be a, I gotta be balanced it's what I'm saying it's what I'm saying I gotta be balanced I gotta be right mind gotta be right heart gotta be right <laughs> gotta be right too. gotta be in alignment okay gotta be in alignment so anyway Speaking of alignment, so yes, I am still calling in my beloved. Let me bounce the ball a little bit. Bouncing does help, you know, get the old brain cooking and the thoughts moving and grooving. <laughs> so I'm still calling in my sacred masculine, my beloved, but I was having a talk with my gal pal. Y'all may know her as med school. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I was talking to Rev and my sister about this calling in the beloved and, and getting out, you know, spring. I'm trying to venture out there, you know, safe. <laughs> Be kind of safe out there. Look in them streets. And uh, venturing into the world again of intimacy. Because, you know, me, I take a little pause. If I don't take a pause, the universe will put me on a pause. The universe will put me on a timeout. Because somebody's not honoring my vibe. Somebody's taking my vibe for, for granted. So the universe will be like, no more sex for you. No more sex. Sex with self? Yes. No more sex with him? And definitely no more sex with... No. Definitely not that guy. Okay? So, <laughs> fasting from any type of intimacy, but still doing my erotic work online with my OnlyFans and other stuff. I honor that. Okay? Y'all know that about me. But I'm not doing any type of... You know, you know, only with myself, loving on myself, loving on me as I do. And I'm okay with that because let's see, we got, there was December. There was some going on, you know, you know, you know, you know, in December. So, nope, January, <laughs> nothing, nah, nah. February, you know, it was love, 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 love month. He had the box on love month. Nothing. Nothing. I was loving all on, all on this. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Loving all on this, y'all. I was loving all on this, okay? 
and, and, and radi radiating out into the world as I do. I was doing that in February. I'm a love goddess, dog on it. So that's what I do. Share my love, 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 love. <laughs> Tits up, vibes all the way up, okay, for the month of February. So we got two months, two months, y'all, under my belt. We're going in, going in deeper, deep, deep. We in Pisces season two. Ooh, Pisces, Pisces love me, Pisces do. Shout out to the Pisces who is no longer my bae, my lover man. Shout out to him, Mr. Nigerian. Okay. <laughs> Shout out to you, Mr. What is it? Benir State <laughs> in Nigeria. Shout out to you. Happy belated birthday to you. We're no longer, you know, doing these, you know, sexy things, sexy things. So I'm, I'm, I'm going in deep for the month of, of March. I, I, I've been doing February. <laughs> Got over the holidays. Look, as my daughter says, yeah, I, I kiss my jiggly arms. I kiss them. <sighs> okay. Got over the holidays, got over Valentine's Day. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Got all, got over all that ish. So I'm ready. I'm continuing. I'm riding this, baby. I'm riding this. <laughs> I'm ready to ride something else. Too. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> hey, how you doing? But anyway, so as spring is approaching, spring eagle not equinox. Is approaching. I, the little goddess, is getting ready to see what's on the horizon for mating season. <laughs> no, choosing season selection. The selection process is going to continue. Continue. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, but here's the thing I'm not going to pick up where I left off. No. You hear me? No. No. So, yeah, I might need to do a little casting call. No, for real. Casting call for some cock. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Casting call for cock. <laughs> I think the line will be down the parkway. <laughs> no, but no, for real. Um, So my vibes are going to be... Very harmonious, very in sync, still me, authentic, you know, who I am showing up with all this jiggly, extra this, this COVID stuff I got going on. Yeah, I'm on my weight loss journey still. Damn it, I got to move some, some things. Yeah, that cortisol, woo, that cortisol hormone kind of like, woo, you know, I got to lower that all the way down. Okay, so I, I kind of figured if you follow me on Twitter, ATL underscore Thick Dream, you realize that some things that I, 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 I've i shared some little aha moments on there at times, little naughty ones and unfiltered raw ones, like, oh, I'm going to tweet that, <laughs> I'm going to tweet that, I don't care, I'm going to tweet it, aha, there was that, when I was a sexually active woman, <laughs> I... I, one, my blood pressure was lower. My cortisol levels were lower. My fluffiness was a lot lower. <laughs> yes, it was. It was. The body was a lot tighter. Like a tiger, as I say on Big Social. Tight like a tiger. <laughs> so, I'm going back into the world of Coitus, ladies and gentlemen, into sexual relations. Yes, I am. But I'm going to be very, very, very meticulous. Kiki, I'm a choosy lover, mother. Ooh, shut your mouth, girl. Um, yeah, y'all. I was talking to men's school and I told her, like, I'm getting out there, like, I'm doing my soul a disservice by not being who it is that I radiate. You know who it is that I feel inside. Like I'm not ashamed that I, I, I am a, a, a sexy, erotic, a quirky, a, you know, serious and it's in a sacred. Damn it. Okay. I am the temple. I am her. She is me. So I am not ashamed to be her, and I honor all that I am. 
Okay, the fuck, look, the fuck. And um, so I'm going to be doing this, and uh, the universe is going to send me some potentials. Maybe some farmers who think they still qualify. They probably won't qualify. They got impressed the hell out of me to qualify. Okay? But um, I'm getting back out there. I don't know when. Like, I'm not going to say, by my birthday, I'm going to be back out in here. I'm going to be out here getting, I'm going to get me some, you know, by my birthday. I'm not going to put a time stamp on when I'm, I'm handing out my... My Yoni, I'm being nice. My Yoni coupons. I used to say my coupons, but I'm going to say my Yoni coupons. I'm not going to put a timestamp because I need a little time. You know, the universe, you put out a little signal. <laughs> In the past, I put out a little distress signal, you know, me, me, my antenna just gets raised up. Like, me, 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 you know, and then, whoo, somebody just, you know, comes in. They get manifested and uh, it's like, nope. That's it, you know, beard, you know, and, you know, and confidence, like, but, eh, eh, flag on feel like, nope, nope, no, whatever the hand thing is, no, he ain't it, I mean, you like, 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 he's almost there, he was almost that, that nigga, that nigga, for real, he was almost that dude, he was almost him, but, uh, he's not that guy for me. You know, nope. So I believe next time, and we're just talking intimate partners, you know, bed buddies, fuck buddies, you know, friends with benefits, whatever you want to call it, sex partners. We exchanging some yummy, you know, sexy moments, sex experiences. So, um, yeah, I still have to be meticulous when doing my mate selection process, okay? So he shall not be like the formers, as I said on Twitter. He will be someone who resonates with me. We're on the same frequency, yada, 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 yada. And not all that fuck shit, not all them gang, none of that shit. And if you got game, you better let me find out. Okay? And it has to be consistent. See, that was a thing, though. Pause. That was the reason why I discontinued some of the associations that I had because they weren't consistent enough. We're in a whole blooded global pandemic, damn it. I need consistent cook. I need consistent cook. Can I say that again? I need consistent penis. I cannot have inconsistent like, oh, we're going to do it here on this day. And then, oh, here's another six weeks. Oh, here. Hi, hi. Oh, I'm showing up at your door. I'm showing up at your door after six weeks. No, 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 no. That, that doesn't satisfy. That does not fly with me. Especially during a pandemic, and you may be, just by default, the only brother that is loving all on me. So, you know. But I've come to realize, not C-U-M, but C-O-M-E. <laughs> I've come to realize that many men believe that the more you have sex with, the more consistent you are with a person, they think it obligates them to maybe forge a relationship of some sort, like boyfriend, girlfriend, we're a couple, you know, we're a thing thing beyond this this sexy thing, you know, that we share, you know, twice a week maybe, you know, because, oh, baby, when I had a real lover, twice a week, if not twice a week, every other week. We were getting it in. Okay? Because we was fucking. <laughs> we was fucking. That's what we supposed to do. We supposed to be fucking. Not this. No. No. None of that. Okay? So whatever bug crawled up his ass, you know, so he's all, he wants me to get in a relationship again. So fuck that. Uh, I'll get in a relationship when the universe, the energy is right. And not when he just say, you know what? You want a man? Okay. And I'm going to put you over here so you can get you a man. See, the camera done went out of focus when I said that shit. The camera couldn't even comprehend. <laughs> I know many of my followers are like, is he crazy? Is he crazy? He let all this go? He let all that go? Yeah, he did. He did. He did. <laughs> he did. Seven years. But that's okay. It's okay. And pretty soon, he won't be in any of my conversations. But he's my friend, you know. I still got love for the brother. 
from the brother. <laughs> Still got love for the man, but not like that. Not like some of the other shit stains that I've grown to know in my adulthood. <laughs> I still got love for him. So anyway, that's about it. I'm going in 25 strong on this this vlog. Um, I want to say it's because I'm being a better me, and I hope you are doing a better you, being a better you on this 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 life campaign, this thing we call our journey. Yeah, type of vlog. Um, some of the dudes on my other pages, my platforms were kind of disappointed because I cut my nails off. Well, honey, they done. I just, shit. Oh, it's 11-11. 11-11, I'm making my wish. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Angels, angels, angels. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for my ancestors. Thank you for my spirit guides. Thank you for the abundance, the health, the sexy, the wisdom, the protection. Thank you for the opulence. Thank you for the courage. Thank you for my viewers today. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much on this wonderful, wonderful Wednesday that we have here in this room. I appreciate you. I love you all. I do, I do. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for the shares. Thank you for the following. Thank you for the renewals. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. And I'll be back to update you. My thing is going off here. <laughs> Look, let me let me crab walk over here and get it turned off on my phone. Thank you so much for being with me on this 11 11, 11, 11 on the 10th of March. Go get y'all some of this sexy vibe with your own. Tend to your inner chi. Your inner chi. And let me get to my waist beating. I love you, love you, love you, Miss Atlanta from MissAtlanticDream.com. DreamsUniverse.me. And OnlyFans got his ATL Big Dream. And that is also many vids too. Didn't I say that? And tumbling. Here we go. Can I bounce it out? Hey. Hey. Mm. This is actually workout. Hey. 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 I can't wait to, you know, do my little sexy wine. I'm a lover man. Mm. Hey. And also, yes, my DMs are closed. You want to reach me? Sickdreamproductions at gmail.com. Thickdreamproductions at gmail.com. That's where you can reach me. Don't text my Google number. Do not. Don't WhatsApp me. Do not. Okay? You can tweet me. Oh, yeah, you can tweet me. I may respond, but don't DM me. Okay, y'all? Make sure you do that if you want to do business with me. And don't forget to refer the lady loves in your life, the goddesses in your life to me so I can get them wasted wasted one thing about wearing waist beads it keeps me in alignment with my self love of course my yummy core but also my femininity yes I like being a girly girl a womanly woman it makes me feel so sensual ooh alright y'all see you soon signing off you too <laughs> Smiling and waving and bouncing. And you know what? Next lover man, you better be ready. We're gonna be physical. Look, physically, physically, physically fit. Mm, 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 mm. Look, get your son. Get your son. Get your son. I love a man who works out, dance, who just keeps moving, who keeps busy doing his business, minding his business. So I look forward to meeting you. And I've been spitting. It's because I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. It's been a long time, you two. <laughs> Moving them. Hips getting that Kundalini going. Ooh, ah! uh, 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 ear, ear. All right, y'all. Hey, 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 hey. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> pussy power, pussy power is all. Point is tip top, okay?
the next move behind the flexibility is oh my god. Okay, so flexible. All right, you love the way I shake it. You love the way I rock it. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Bye. The Love Goddess is signing off. Miss Atlanta Dream dot com. I love you. Bye, baby. <sighs> See you soon, baby. I don't know. Maybe. maybe. Yeah. Thank you for being in my energy on this Wednesday.